Hi, is it just me or does RPM really love photo ops? Trudeau was recently photographed jogging past a group of students taking prom photos in Vancouver. The picture was splashed all over Canadian and international media. It was sold as a photobomb moment because the teens were oblivious to JT running by. Or were they? Turns out the whole thing was orchestrated for a publicity campaign. Yeah, that's right. It couldn't be a photobomb since Trudeau's personal photographer took the picture. Nothing about it is accidental. It was totally staged. But it's not the first time Trudeau has conveniently appeared in a stranger snapshot. In fact, he does it a lot. Remember this photo from a wedding in Tofino? Who's that topless guy over there watching the wedding? He looks familiar. Wait a second. Is that our prime minister showing off his pecs? And here's another bride posing for the camera with her bridal party. And there's her new hubby. Aw, they're so cute. Oh, wait, wait a second. Doesn't he look like Justin Trudeau? I thought he was married to Sophie. Ah, oh, this is so confusing. Oh, hey, here's another shot of the PM topless. He was supposedly on a hike in Quebec and just happened to pop out of a cave without a shirt on. What are the odds of that? He's starting to remind me of that other world leader that likes to go shirtless in photos. And speaking of stage publicity, there was that time that the propaganda press lost their minds over the fake quantum computing question. And the uncertainty around quantum uh, states uh, allows us to encode more information into a much uh, smaller computer. Yeah, the whole thing was clearly memorized, but with help from Trudeau's media fan club, the video went viral. But no amount of topless fake photo bombs can measure up to his previous craze, selfies. He's probably best known for his love of self-portraits. His nickname is the Prime Minister of Selfies. He takes them with babies, with famous actors and musicians, and even with his bromance partner, then-President Barack Obama. Other politicians couldn't stop laughing about the whole thing, which caused the libs to get a wee bit sensitive. And who could forget Justin's recent cardboard cutout debacle? That was referred to. <laughs> you know the one where the Fed spent 1900 bucks on 14 life-size cutouts of the PM, all meant to promote Canadian values? It all really comes across as narcissistic. And I'm totally over it. How about you?